getting dressed for school was that easy that would be great but it's not <laughs> what's up you homies it's your homegirl natalie and today i am coming at you with a back to school lookbook my first one um i haven't been back to school in years personally how i dressed for uni was a little bit out there i've always been a little bit out there i actually wore heels every single day of uni and actually every single day since sophomore year of high school like i've worn heels all the time i've tried to i guess tone it down a little bit for this lookbook um i hope you guys enjoy it and yeah maybe i'll see you at the end maybe not i don't know anyways okay <laughs> bye first day of school can be super nerve-wracking but it doesn't have to be dressing up always gave me confidence so i put together a casual but fun outfit you can't go wrong with a loose halter dress, it's so easy to dress up, or you can dress it down like how I did with this thrifted denim jacket that showcases my shameless love for anime. I wore some other hints of green to make the outfit come together, and then paired it with my go-to black booties from G Market. Nothing gives me more strength to take on the week like repping one of the most kick-ass ladies from my childhood, Sailor Mars. I toughened up the tee with its zip front skirt from Monkey, and going with the Japan feels, I threw on my Tokyo Bomber from Spins. Now you might say, Natalie, you might come off as a weeaboo. Well, if someone wants to judge me, that's on them, because I'm blessed and unbothered, let me tell you, okay? Following the pink cues, I wore my favorite style of earrings at the moment, and my dusty pink booties. <laughs> By the time Wednesday rolls around, you might be already over school, so this is my take on the sweatpants to class look. I'm wearing this gray off the shoulder top that gives some sporty vibes and tucked it into my favorite trousers from GU. Putting some more effort into the outfit, I wore double earrings and these acrylic ones give me kind of like a mini pep talk. Natalie, you made it through half the week. Boom, you're awesome. <laughs> and lastly, slipped into my purple loafers for a pop of color. <laughs> My Thursday look has to be my favorite outfit. You all have seen me wear this look time and time again. It's really a combo of things that I just love to wear. I wore one of my favorite off the shoulder tops and then went the casual route with my only, only super comfy high waisted blue jeans. Next, I amped up the color by pairing these bright earrings from Spins and tying a little chiffon scarf for extra detail. Yeah, Friday is here! And I saved an outfit that can easily be worn after class to a congratulatory end of the first week dinner with your homies or a night out to dance the week off. This top is no stranger to any of you guys, but I went a different route with my bottoms and wore this floral skirt. The overall color scheme of this outfit is quite neutral, so I went with these big white Sailor Moon earrings and a hat to top it all off. <laughs> When you're trying to be professional, comfy, and want to pull off a hat like this as easily as Samuel Jackson does, well, no worries, I have the outfit for you. I wore an all-black number here, starting with a basic black crop top and comfy culottes from A-Land. This blazer gives off more of a polished look, but it's actually super duper comfy. So to match the blazer, I wore my gold Kinji earrings, then popped on this cute and funky black hat. Finally, I slipped into my favorite meals at the moment to bring it all together. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie.